Hey there friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and if you've watched any of these videos at all, you may recognize that right there is where my Glowforge is supposed to be connected. Uh, I went to fire it up here at school, and it does not connect again. So, my room looks like this. Right there is my vent, we're on the outside wall, and right there is the school Wi-Fi. So for some reason, if I take my Glowforge all the way to this side of the building, run an extension cord, take it out into the hallway, all of a sudden, everything works like it's supposed to. In the room, I was able to get the green dot, but I could not get a Wi-Fi signal to show up. And now by simply coming outside my room that few feet, I am able to get it to connect, continue, and do everything just like it's supposed to. There is my lovely Glowforge THX363, which did not exist in my room. I'm going to give it the little connect. Then we'll get that cool window that shows us the ones we can pick from. And I'll connect it to my building, just like it's supposed to be. There we have that magic device found. And there we have the magic screen where I can pick my network and get back in business. Simply type in the password and connect and boom, we are back to 3D printing. Alrighty friends, so the moral of the story is sometimes you've got to leave the room to connect your Glowforge. It makes no sense that mine is like this. My room, I've talked to my IT guy, there's no reason I'm right under the Wi-Fi. But hey, I found a solution and it does work. So if you have trouble connecting, you to make sure you find a place where it connects as well. If you found the video useful, all my friends, please hit the like button. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button and last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know this brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.